Hey guys, so this will be a quick little speed test between these two. I'm gonna go ahead and reboot both right now, see which one reboots faster. Let's go. On the left, we have the Galaxy S8 Plus in midnight black with a Snapdragon 835 and four gigs of RAM versus the OnePlus 3T, also in midnight black. This is the 128 gigabyte model with a Snapdragon 821 and six gigs of RAM, a beast in its own right. And as you can see right there, the 3T rebooted faster, followed immediately by the S8. If you're wondering where my cracked Galaxy S8 is, it's right here in its full glory. All right, this phone has been getting a lot of, a lot of love, also a lot of hate. It is what it is. So yeah, there you go. Honorable mention. All right, show you guys something real quick. On the S8 Plus, since the 3T is in 1080p resolution, I put the S8 in 1080p too. I'm gonna go to settings on both. System updates. Check for updates. And both are on their latest UI, all right? So I'm gonna clear everything now. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start the speed test. I'm gonna start opening a bunch of apps, starting with the phone app. Let's go. Faster on the 3T. All right, the camera. I'm gonna do it like this. Let's go. Very similar on both. Let me know in the comments, you guys be the judge. Okay, we have the calculator, go. Very similar. Couldn't actually tell which one was faster there. All right, now we have the uh, browsers. Samsung browser on the S8 and Chrome on the 3T. Go. Faster on the 3T. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and search for New York Times. Go. Faster on the S8. Go. Faster this time on the 3T. We'll scroll through this like butter. Look at how fast that is on both. Very nice. All right, I'm gonna click on this Obama warned Trump. All right, I'm gonna click on that, go. And 3T was a little bit faster there. What is this, remind me later. Now get this out of the way. Scroll through this. Not a problem. All right, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go to Apple's website. Go. And I couldn't really tell which one was faster there. Okay. Similar performance on both phones. So you can see kind of going through this. Very nice on both. All right, I'm gonna get out of there. All right, next up, we have Yelp, go. And that is the same on both. All right, next up, Snapchat, go. Faster on the 3T. We have Spotify. Faster on the S8. Okay, we have eBay. Faster on the S8. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this right here, go. And couldn't really tell which one was quicker there. All right, now onto some games. We have Angry Birds, go. And the three T's jumping ahead followed by the S8 Plus, and the 3T is faster here. 
followed immediately by the S8 Plus. Here we go. We'll just leave it there. All right, Super Mario Run, go. Faster on the 3T. Subway Surf. SA jumping ahead. Will the 3T catch up? And S8. Quicker here. Followed by the 3T. Temple Run 2 game. S8 jumping ahead, and the S8 is way ahead. There you go. All right, now let's take a look at the multitasking on both here. The phone. With the camera app. There you go. What is this? Calculator. We have Chrome here. All right. Yup. And we have both refreshing there. I don't think that was a full reload. Snapchat. Spotify. Right there. eBay. Right, right on that item. Angry Birds. No issues. Very nice. Mario Run. Again, right there. No issues. Subway Surf Game. Go. No issues. Temple Run 2 in RAM. And are we done here? I think we are done and back to the phone app we are. So as you can see in this test, both phones are performing really, really good. Now I gotta give mad props to the uh, OnePlus 3T here. This phone is pretty cool. Just a quick comparison now of the aesthetics of both. This is, they're both in their midnight black colorway. So you can see all black front, the back is also all black. Take a good look at that right there. If you were to choose between one or the other, you know, like the OnePlus 3T has more of a stock-ish kind of Android build. This phone has a ton of customizations though. A lot of gestures, you can customize these buttons to basically whatever you want. So yeah, the OnePlus 3T, you know, definitely has a fan base. And the S8 Plus has a curved display. It's a sexy phone. Camera's pretty good on it, obviously. One is 440, more of a budget slash mid-range type of device, whereas the S8 is the full flagship phone. Yeah, just a quick little speed test between these two. Hope you enjoyed the video, found it helpful. Thanks for watching. Peace out.